I'm going to turn back to the video. We are here with another episode. Let's talk about it. So I'm not going to lie to you. YouTube was a little broke for a second. But when I came back on YouTube, I see this video right here. Russell Westbrook traded away three-team deal reaction rant thoughts and review for flight. So this says the Jazz will send Mike Conley and the picks to the Timberwolves while Russell Westbrook and a lightly protected 2027 LA first round pick head to the Jazz. Here, yep, here come Woj, the Woj bombs. Lakers are finalizing deal to land Minnesota D'Angelo Russell, Malik Beasley, who is the wannabe Donovan Mitchell dude, and, John, and whoever this is, Jared Vanderbilt, and trade, including Mike Conley to. And picks to the Timberwolves and Russell Westbrook and the lightly protected to the Jazz. So Russell Westbrook about to get sent to Utah. So that's crazy. What's crazy is I was just saying to myself, Russell do got a price on the back of his jersey, right? I said Russell got a uh, 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 he has a price on the back of his jersey because we've seen that video of LeBron going like these. Go ahead and pick him up. Russell about to be in the same neighborhood as NBA Young Boy. That's crazy. So the Lakers are getting D'Angelo Russell back. And Mike Conley is going to the Timberwolves. I have to see this in 2K. I, I don't know. We, we might have to turn on 2K just to see what it looked like. But we're going to watch this real quick. Like then, you know. Hey! It. Okay, I might be in the way. You move out the way. Here we go. Let's go. Russell Westbrook is officially out of Los Angeles. Home run. Grand slam. See you. I already told you LeBron was, you know, when he threw that pass out of belts. And I said he's on a QB1. That was him throwing his bags across the room. Later. This That's is tough. the most disrespectful timing trade in NBA history, bro. The Lakers have no remorse. Well, at least I can say Russell Westbrook is free. Bro, I knew it! <laughs> Did you see my pass yesterday? That bad! You, LeBron! And what's crazy is Flight said he got 48 hours for your journey. <laughs> That's crazy. We covered that. We reacted to Bro, he overthrew LeBron in the... Yeah, see, here you go. I seen that. I said, bro, Pat... Pack your bags. You got 48 hours to get out your house. <laughs> he's end up getting traded anyway. You have 48 That's hours. That's crazy. It hasn't even been 24. It hasn't even been 24 hours. The trade deadline's tomorrow. said 48. I can get him going in 16. <laughs> what? Let's make it one more party day in with LeBron. No, that was his last day. You ruined his night, so you got to go. Anybody that ruined LeBron night is getting traded. Okay, so now it's trending trade Anthony Davis. Oh, man. Huge <laughs> about to go down. In the middle of the game. It's like that, oh, Lakers. Man. Now, disclaimer, I'm not a fan. You know what I'm saying? Of none of the teams that was involved in this. Can the Warriors make a trade, please? Free trade. I'm tired of the Lakers. Hey. The Lakers popped up the last trade. With Kyle, hey, bro. Bro, I told you guys it was going to happen, man. I seen it coming. This is, this is, this, hey, Lakers... They got to be the most ruthless sports franchise in history, I think, bro. <laughs> like, you couldn't let Russell get one more day to just No, that was it. his last day. You got to know the Lakers fans different, bro. I know we Warriors fans, but Lakers fans? You mess up LeBron day, Kobe day, you get traded the next morning. His friend LeBron, Simple. you know what I'm saying? It looks like they close off the court or whatever, you know what I'm saying? Like, no, they not. Hey, That's why he go. <laughs> That's why he go. Let him sink in just that moment. Where's that oh, video at? Oh, man, nah, bro. There's a video of LeBron it's tapping Russell in, Westbrook's back. As you guys see right here from multiple credible sources, you know what I'm saying? The Adrian dude, you got ESPN. You got my Russell man Charizard, I think, that uh, tweeted Westbrook. out this stuff, too. Um, bro, that? Russell Westbrook is out of here. This looks like the easier one to uh, read. Bro, this... First of all, this is kind of a strange-ass trade. Because if you guys remember, Russell... Uh, D'Angelo Russell, D whatever you want to call him, he was with the worried about that. Y'all, y'all seen it already. Four or five, six years ago. Why do they yeah. all of a sudden want him back now? He's not about to do nothing. <laughs> Being like Russell Westbrook for real. This, this, you can literally tell that they was thirsty, bro. 
to get rid of Westbrook. They they've been having this plotted plan out. And the thing is, that's crazy. Is that they probably had other trade options that they wanted to explore and wanted to Watch try out trip. with other teams. Those teams probably was just like, "What drugs are y'all on?" You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't think nobody really I wanted Russell, man. And I honestly, that's lie, crazy. I kind of feel bad. I do feel bad. You know what I'm saying? I do feel bad. In Somebody way. said I made a Photoshop of an old D-Lo picture. He tried his hardest. He did have a, a, a decent improvement. You know, Russell about to have a triple double again. Watch. I'm saying for a good time in the season. And all you go here is Cash Nasty and, and, and Oprah side Clark. What would you do this for the world team? From you know, I'm saying, you would have been traded if you was acting like this on the Lakers. Same. Uh, you know what? Well, averaging sixteen hey, bro, plus see, points he, game, he played four, another four, power. Six, seven assists. I kind of, I, I don't know about it. Maybe I may be tripping, but I kind of feel oh, bad, man. This is this. this so you don't got to, cause he gonna happen to triple double again. What? Disrespectful. This, this is. Say that my dog to the Jazz. He gonna be around the corner from Young Boy House. He'll be all right. Sucks. Um. So here you got the breaking news right here. The Lakers, they said they're finalized today, which basically means that this, this this trade has already gone through. It's just like an early, you know what I'm saying, tweet. And then, like, which I highly doubt if this just doesn't go through. Well, yeah, it's not going to feel the same seeing Russell Westbrook. Obviously, well, it's, make it's not going to feel the same. I, mean, just to confirm it I was enjoying it. Because we always want to be 100% credible ourselves, duh. But, you know what I'm saying? It looks like pretty much like, who's going to be trying to, like, you know what I'm saying, work overtime for, this is just, you know, I, I'm not trying to be messed up either, like, these, these these guys trading involved. All three of these guys are casuals. There's not a guy. There's not a, a man or woman. Yeah, I told you, Malik Beasley. He's the one to be Donovan Mitchell. He's a casual. Jared Vanderbilt is a cat. He's a, he's he's a 24 hour fitness player. I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't even know who that is. Uh, no, that's that's the Wizards. I was about to say that's the dude that did the KD pose, the Spider Man pose when KD crossed him, but that's that's not him. Yeah, he's he's a twenty four hour fitness player. Malik Beasley is the one to be Donovan Mitchell with all the accessories on. D'Angelo Russell is average. Like he he's cool, but he's not like that, like how people thought he was when he was coming out of Ohio State. They thought he was about to be really him. But he's 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 cool, but he's kinda a casual too. He's a he's a He's like a, 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 a like a, a high seventies, low eighties type of hooper in real life. Yeah, that's crazy. Mike Conley cool, but he kind of old now. You know, if it was Grizzlies, Conley would been different. Russell Westbrook is going to the Jazz with a lightly protected pick, which means in two thousand twenty seven, you're getting traded to the Jazz in the morning. The Lakers it says, "Let me watch some Russell Westbrook highlights." Some D uh, D low highlights or some uh, McConley and Michael highlights in 2023. Not in his day of age, no sir. I'm telling you, that's what I'm saying. Don't no take an offense, but um, okay. So Russell, D'Angelo Russell, Beasley, Malik. So it's a pair of um, uh, socks. So D low a pair. So this is kind of like a pair of socks and drawers. Like that's basically what this is. It's just a pair of socks and some drawers. That's socks it. And some drawers and half eaten apple. Uh, are going apple. to the Lakers. <laughs> All right. So Russell is returning to the Lakers when he used to play for them. You yeah, he was there when Kobe was there. I don't know how you Lakers fans feel about that. What is Russell average about? Like, what, 10 to 15 points per game? I honestly don't think that... Bro, I ain't gonna lie to you. That's high key a downgrade. If you... if you, It is. If, if you're saying that it's it not is. a downgrade, let me see it what is. McConley and Michael doing. The Jazz will send McConley and Michael pitch to the Timberwolves, Russell Westbrook... I ain't gonna lie to you. This this is a good little pickup for Minnesota though, because it, it, even though Mike Conley is like a, a OG casual now, he he'll be good for Anthony Edwards, cause so he don't gotta do everything, you know. At least and Mike Conley can play point guard. Twenty twenty seven L A first round pick. Yeah, that's getting traded. I'm what telling you that now. If, if it's lightly, he's getting traded. What does that even mean? The lightly he's getting traded. I don't care who it is. So unless it's a top five pick, it's a heavy he protected trade. and lightly protected. What is that even supposed to mean? I don't know. Nah, what that bro. Means. I ain't even lying to you, bro. Whoever that is, I feel baffled. The Lakers are getting ripped off because they're basically like giving up athleticism, stamina. You know what I'm saying? Really, he was hoping last game he made four threes. Six, what do you think D Lo about to do? Hardcore aggressive defense. Now we really gotta watch every Lakers game now. You know what I'm saying? You thought he was watching them all before? For, you know, guys, come on, bro. 
Bro, I'm dropping off D-Lo 11 zip in a 1v1, bro. This dude doesn't no, have no defense. But I think he's <laughs> probably like a top five. No, he, go, he might score on D-Lo because D-Lo don't play defense. So he might score on D'Angelo Russell, but Flay, you lost to the seventh grader, bro. Like, how do I feel about ball. that? You know what I'm saying? What he has say? a little talent, just a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Like 10 to 15 points per game. But, I mean, if you have common, like, common sense and your IQ is a decent, you know what I'm saying, like, number – Anybody can guard D Lo, man. You know what I'm saying? He's not that much of like an, an elite, elite impressive, impressive, you know what I'm saying, I'm player. Saying. You know what I'm saying? That's true. Um, but you know, he's enough to be a casual, you know what I'm saying, I guess. But I, I think the Lakers are like they why did they downgrade like that? You know what I'm saying? I feel like they could have got at least somebody like better, you know, but I mean, I don't know, bro. Um Yeah, we gotta see what this looks like in two K get Westbrook out of there or what. But this trade yeah, now is kind of like taking a time to process everything because it just happened. Right, this is Copyright live, right? music. you know what I'm saying, as we usually do. Um, this I'll is a downgrade for, for, for the Lakers. Why would that. you no, trade you away? At, and as much as we roast Westbrook, you know what I'm saying, I still get credit for where it's due. You guys should know that by now. You know what I'm saying? Westbrook, let's be he's Decent day where he's, you know what I'm saying, he got his mind right and everything. He's about an 83 overall, 84. You tra basically traded for... You know what I'm saying? D Lo is around a 72 at this point of his career. 70 72? <laughs> That's crazy. D Lo ain't that trash. He ain't no 72. D Lo, like I said, he's like a he's like a high 70s, low, really low 80s, like 80 at most. We go we gonna see. We gonna see. We're gonna check his uh ratings in just a second. And then you also traded, you know what I'm saying, for a 40 overall. Who is the Beasley and Malik dude? Who is this? What are you overall? You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> I don't know why the Lakers would screw themselves over no. like that. And then they also gave up like a protected first round pick. That sounds like something exclusive. That Does that mean that you get like five picks in the first round or something? I don't even know. I think the Lakers really took an L in this trade. The Lakers definitely took the L in this trade, bro. They're definitely not making the playoffs anymore, bro. I was mm -hmm. going to give you the benefit of the doubt to make the plan. You guys might as well just start getting ready for next season, bro. You know what that's I'm saying? crazy. Like, D-Lo, I don't even think it's... LeBron's still for the league. Damn it, I ain't gonna lie to you. Like Y'all that messed up his night. LeBron went through with the Celtics, throwing a temper tantrum. Y'all messed up LeBron night, his senior night last night. Y'all messed it up. You keep losing like this, he's finna leave. You think you know he gonna I mean, stay? Really slow with dribbling with the ball. The thing about Westbrook is that, let's be honest, like... He has handles. He know what we do. We all know he's clumsy. He turns the ball over. We get that, okay? But his handles is decently above a 90-plus. If you're not sitting agreeing with that, you're just a hater. You know what I'm saying? Like, I would never trade, you know what I'm saying, a street ball type of, like, crafty ball handler type of dude. You know what I'm saying? For, like, someone that can – like, D-Lo has, like, the dribbles of prestigious a casual tryhard at, like, LA Fitness on, like, a Wednesday, bro. Watch you know what I'm it, creator. He doesn't have anything elite. And prestigious then, stat, bro. How are y'all commenting he's he not even streaming? I don't even think he's going to be playing. So why would you even trade for this? They don't think he's going to be playing, bro. You know what I'm saying? He doesn't have anything elite. And then the Beasley and Malik, dude, I don't even think he's going to be playing. Oh, yeah, he ain't finna get in the game. What? Malik Beasley and Jared Vanderbilt are they about to be having LeBron Gatorade? Get him his towels. They not for that. What are they about to do? They not gonna go on the court and do nothing anyway. So why would you? So even it's just like for this? you know, they could have got they had LeBron some more Gatorades a little faster. I guess Russell wasn't doing that at the at the speed and pace that he plays on the court. So they decided to get two new people to hand LeBron more Gatorade and more. Towels at a faster pace. Got something way better. Like they gotta I, be that. Cause I'm not understanding it. Like, what do they bring to the table for the like Lakers? The only player that I can think that's really like that that'll actually make sense. There's hella more, bro. You could get someone like the KPJ dude from like the Rockets. You know what I'm saying? You could have got. I mean, I think he's injured, but like that's crazy. Lonzo Ball, I mean, well, he did play with the Lakers, so that's kind of contradicting myself. But even like Lonzo, I feel like would be better. Lonzo need to play two minutes before uh, he get traded. Other, you know what I'm saying? So, Lonzo ain't played a game in almost three years. Teams. I'm surprised. He's hurt. Is CP3 still in the league? I was thinking maybe. Even now, I will tell you this: if the Lakers would have got Chris Paul, they would have known it was LeBron's fault that Russell get traded.
That's why they didn't get Chris Paul. They would have got Chris Paul. They know it's LeBron doing something behind the scenes. We say the GM anyway, but we already know if they get Chris Paul, it's definitely LeBron saying something. Get Chris Paul or I'm leaving. He could have got, you know what I'm saying, for that. Get Chris Paul or I'm I'm leaving. Who else? And even as much as I hate to admit this, I'd rather have them have Drew Holiday, somebody like the, a player like them. That would have been Holiday. way more valuable than get someone like D'Lo, bro. And it's like, like, like I'm saying, it's no offense. He's a he's a cool, casual dude, but he is a cool like, casual. Let's be hundred percent honest, bro. Come on. He said he's a seventy. I don't know why the Lakers <laughs> did it to themselves. Man. That's crazy. Um, it's gonna be a long rest of the season for them, especially after All Star break. I definitely see a lot of, um, you know what I'm saying, straps on the sideline, a lot of arguing on the sideline. Russell, Russell about to have his own team. He about to have a triple-double watch. Um, He's averaging a triple-double again because he has his own team. Um, it's not going to do They finna have Russell, Mark Cunning. Yeah, they going to be cool. they not going to really be making a whole lot of noise, but they're going to be cool, though. They're not going to make the playoffs. Jordan Clarkson. not going to make the playoffs for the next 10 years. Um, they're going to be cool. They're not going to make a lot of noise. They're going to be cool, though. The year, they might have They'll be a nice 2K team. Uh, the Timberwolves, I'll tell you that. I think they're in like, the playing position, but they're going to get bounced off the first round. So, I mean, overall, if you're looking at maybe longevity, long term, that's probably what they were thinking of. I guess it may be an even trade all across the board. But if you're talking about right now, hell no, bro. The Lakers definitely sold really bad. You can tell they want to get rid of Westbrook right now. And that's why I don't... I kind of like feel bad, you know what I'm saying? They they, they just kind of like wanted to get rid of him last year. You know what I'm saying? I really feel bad. Nah, it was really just the fans that wanted him go last year. This year, it's just like it, it was a done deal. I hope Westbrook can, you know what I'm saying? Keep he just it. had his what from October till February, October, November, December, January. He had a four month trial. It, was, uh, it just expired. And everything like that. Right um, around All Star Weekend. To prosper and maybe who knows? Maybe he can have like a comeback season. Maybe him and I know in the Jazz. Or no no he went to the um the Timberwolves. Wait, no he's going to the Jazz. Head to the Jazz. They're gonna be cool. Mike Conley going to the Timberwolves. I think. Yeah, Mike Conley to the Timberwolves, Russell to the Jazz, and these casuals to the Lakers. Now I'm thinking about it too because I'm just realizing it now. He's with the Timberwolves. Maybe he might be in a better franchise. I know the cat dude has been injured recently. Rudy Gobert just came back. No, if Russell went to the Timberwolves, they would have been they would have made noise. Cause it would have been Russell, Cat, Kermit, Anthony Edwards. You know, they would have made some noise. You know what I'm saying? They, they, they a solid second round team. I'll tell you that. You know what I'm saying? They they might they gotta make hey, it a second round though. They might be a second round team now, thinking about it, because I'm I Yeah, see they would have made second round. I got confused a little bit. I thought he was with the uh Jazz. Jazz. But now I'm looking at it, Westbrook is actually with the better team. Hey, the Timberwolves, y'all better welcome him in the warm arms, bro. He's not playing for the Timberwolves. Why? What are you talking about? It says right here, Russell Westbrook and whoever this person's about to be headed to the Jazz. They still going to be cool because they're going to have more cut in the Clarkson. Ain't nobody like the Timberwolves get to like at least a third round or something like that. And they're not going to. You're obviously going to get dropped off by the Warriors and everything like that. But, bro, he low-key went to a better team. We need to make we need to make trades today. Team, but the Lakers sold. That's the weird part. I'm tired, of, I'm tired of Wiseman not playing. That irritates me because it's just like you're seven foot for what? It's like you, you kind of like Curry keep getting hurt. That means he's doing too much. If Curry is continuously getting hurt, that means Curry is doing too much for the team right now, and he hasn't done since 2015, 16. It's time to get somebody in there. To help him. Like, like sold on a trade. Do it too much. And then he's going to end up in a better situation. So it's going to be like. The 30 a game and all that. This like, is the most so. disrespectful, weirdest, and confusing trade that I think a sports team has made, like, in the last five years. Yeah, we, we got we to gotta check out the stuff that we're about to go talk. You know what I'm saying? But anyways, that's it. We just realized, witnessed Russell Westbrook getting traded to the Utah Jazz. What y'all think? How is this going to work out? Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe to the channel. And I'll see y'all in the next video, man.